welcome back to youtube channel and today we are going to see how to fix overleaf server error sorry if something went wrong issue so overleaf is a popular online platform for collaborating latex editing enabling researchers students and professionals to work on academic papers and documents seamlessly one common error message users may encounter is sorry something went wrong and your project could not be compiled please try again in a few moments before getting into the solution make sure you hit the like and subscribe button so that you will not miss the upcoming videos the common reasons are issue with your internet connectivity so check corrupted browser cache and cookies and third browser extension or plugins and outdated and unsupported browser invalid domain access Let's see the fixes one by one. Refresh the page. The simple page refresh can sometimes resolve temporary server glitches. So click the refresh button on your browser or press F5 to reload the page and check the server if it is working fine. Solution number two, clear browser cache and cookies. So follow the steps. Open Chrome and click on the three dot menu icon in the top right corner and select more tools then click on bro clear browsing data in the pop-up window select the ba basic tab choose a time range as all time to clear all cache and cookies and check this boxes next to cookies and other site data and cache to image files click on the clear data button if you are using the mozilla firefox then go click on the three dot line menu icon in the top right corner select options and go to privacy setting under the cookies and site data section click on the clear data button in the pop-up window check the boxes next to cookies and cache web content click on the clear button if you are using a microsoft edge then open edge and click on the three dot menu icon in the top right corner select settings and go to privacy search and services tab under the clear browsing data section choose what to clear button check the boxes next to cookies and the size other site data and cache images and files click on the clear button if you are using a safari safari and click on safari in the top menu bar select preferences and go to privacy tab click on the manage website data button in the pop-up window click on remove all button confirm the action by clicking on remove now solution number three use incognito or private mode so to use incognito private mode simply open a new window or tab in your browser and select the option from the menu or using the keyboard shortcut press ctrl shift plus n for google chrome ctrl shift plus p for mozilla firefox and microsoft edge so that the new private window will open and now try preloading the overleaf portal solution number four disable browser extensions and plugins if it is a google click on the three dot menu icon and more tools and go to extensions toggle off switch next to the extension to disable it for mozilla firefox click on the three line menu icon and click on add-ons in the extension tab click on the three dot menu icon next to the extensions and choose disable if it is an edge click on the three dot menu icon and go to extensions toggle off the switch next to the extensions to disable it if you are using a safari go to safari menu preferences and extensions uncheck the box next to the extensions to disable it solution number five update or change your browser ensure that your browser is up to date and with the latest version and is supported by overleaf if you continue to encounter the error then try using the different browsers so step for google chrome for updating the browser check the three dot menu icon click on help click on about google chrome so chrome will automatically check for update and install them if available relaunch chrome to apply the updates if it is in microsoft edge click on the three dot menu icon go to help and feedback and about microsoft edge edge will automatically check for updates and install them if available relaunch edge to apply the updates step for safari click the apple menu and go to system preferences 
Select software updater to check for the Mac OS update, which may include Safari updates. Install any available updates as prompted. Solution number 6. Try access your Overleaf account via a different computer or device. If the issue persists, then try login with the sorry, alternative device or computer. If it is working fine, then you need to uh, reinstall the browsers. Solution number 7. Connect using a different network. This, sorry, there might be a network related issue and the ISP provided are the router blocking the link uh, due to some reason so switching to a different network such as your home wi-fi or your uh, work network or even using your mobile data can help to resolve the issue solution number eight switch to a different dns so dns dissolution failure can occur if the different dns servers provided by your internet service provider or private network is experiencing issue or outdated by switching to a mobile reliable DNS server such as Google public DNS server, you can resolve the DNS related problems. If it is in Mac OS, click on the Apple menu in the top left corner of the screen and select system preference. Then go to network and select your active internet connection and click on advanced. Go to DNS tab and click on plus button and enter 8.8.8.8 in the primary DNS server and 8.8.4.4 in the secondary DNS server. Click OK, then apply to save the changes. If it is in window, open your control panel and go to network and sharing center. Click on change adapter settings. Right click on the network connection and click on properties. In the properties window, scroll down and double click on internet protocol version 4. In the open dialog box, use the following DNS address. That is 8.8.8.8 .8 next to the preferred DNS server and 8.8.4.4 to the alternate DNS server. Click OK to save the changes. Now restart your system and check Overleaf website. Solution number 9. Check domain access. Review your network or system configuration to confirm no restrictions on accessing the compiles.overleaf.com domain. Adjust any necessary settings to allow full access to Overleaf's required domain. I hope you found this video useful. Please hit like and subscribe button for more such videos. Thank you.